But we start with today being Monday and the first day for many students around the Miami Valley, high school and college included. And that does include Central State University, Trotwood Madison Schools, and the area's biggest district, Dayton Public Schools. Well, this year, DPS is welcoming a new interim superintendent, and he says they will be welcoming some changes to the district, especially with how students are transported. 2 News reporter Kajasia Hawkins is here live in the studio with details on what some of those changes will be. Kajasia? Yeah, well, now parents will be able to track their K through 8th grade students location at all times with ID badges while they ride DPS buses. The company behind it, Tyler Technology, is the largest busing service to provide this type of technology, serving over 2,500 school districts in the U.S. and Canada. Now they're bringing their services to Dayton Public School students in kindergarten through 8th grade. The, te the technology works in five parts, starting with routing software for directions, a telematic GPS system, a tablet for drivers, RFD for students to swipe, and an app for parents so that they can see their students' location. They say all of the parts work together to ensure efficiency, and the MyRide K-12 parent app is a great way for parents to avoid first day of school confusion. The common thing first day of school is, hey, where is my, where is my student going to pick up the bus and where are they going to get off? It tells them that. So it, the first thing it does for everybody is it makes all that information accessible to the parent. And then as they're going through the day, they can, <clears throat> the, the, uh, the parent will know where that child got on and off the bus and what time they did that. And coming up at 6, you'll hear more about the first day of school transportation for Dane Public Schools from the interim superintendent. Reporting live in the studio, Kajaja Hawkins, 2 News.